Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of EMC to the Sky. This is episode 4 and I hope you guys enjoy this one. In the last episode, we got all of this done. This entire area, which we're going to have to expand already. And all these coke ovens done. All of these blast furnaces done. But also, we finished making the metal press, which is one step on the way to making the tier 2s. Next, we need to actually make power to power this thing. So, what we're going to have to do is make some water wheels, uh, just to have it start working. So, we're going to make a little section of water wheels, just to make them really work really quickly. Uh, it shouldn't take that long. I don't know if we actually really need them. Probably, we'll just make a few. It's not going to take that long. It's probably the easiest thing and they also look kind of cool but in between episodes we finished off this section here we just like covered it up uh and so everything should be exporting into here and now it's actually working all the way up to this one it was only working up to like here before but now that's full and now this is working as well so the iron should be coming in a little quicker just in preparation for us getting a tier two because it does take quite a while to get anything in the tier twos well like they, they run around the same time i'm gonna sleep really quickly actually um they run around the same time they take a much about the same amount of time but it's more expensive to get the tier twos so it's just gonna be a little tedious so if we had a bank at the beginning uh and just to kind of start then that would be really really useful so i'm glad that we have a good amount here um uh, all right so here there are two baby cows which is weird i thought they only had one i didn't realize that there was two i don't know how that happened but since we're here <laughs> what i'm gonna really quickly do is make uh chickens and sheep well actually uh i need chickens uh these are fine actually what i need to do is make a pig bait or actually no there's, is there pig bait I actually don't know there's pig bait pig bait is made of carrots i guess that's we had to make it like that i remember when i did this last time pigs just like naturally spawned so i was like oh yeah that's fine but i, I do need it i think for completing or no i actually don't i think you just need the chickens because you need feathers and eggs so you just need them to hatch an egg and also for them to like die and drop a feather so okay so we'll wait for that but for now where the hell did we put down the emc system it's in our inventory. Okay, great. Uh, what I'm going to do is expand this area really quickly and just make it a little bit bigger so then we can also put a fence around it and make sure that they don't die in the process um, of like breeding around here. So that should be okay. Uh, what I'm going to do is get the braided wood around. I also need some fencing. The only fencing we have is dark oak fence, which is what I want to use anyways. Um, I really like these chiseled blocks. These braided blocks are so pretty. Oh my God, they're so nice. Oh man. Okay, so this will complete the animal section, the animal pen section. Hopefully the chicken has grown and it is being born over there now um now we can finish off this little fence and now we don't have to worry about them jumping off because they definitely would do that or push each other off if there's enough entities hello chicken <laughs> that's exactly what i'm talking about don't jump off please for god's sakes don't jump off okay so there we go so now we also have sheep bait and we also have uh, an extra chicken bait this one still hasn't been made yet i'm gonna leave that there um the other one should be fine i think it just said it was shy or something uh i'm too close yes so let's stay over here uh, i think i can say this far because the other one just appeared out of nowhere while i was waiting so you know so what we're gonna do is get wheat um and some seeds so we can draw all the animals over here just in case um, because they might be scared of each other, which is very possible. Um, these guys, I do want to kind of have them grow up, so maybe we'll have them grow quickly. And last but not least, put some torches down, because it is kind of dark in here. So this is capable of spawning monsters, so I don't want that to happen. There we go, and there we go. All right, perfect. So I'm probably not going to make the pig bait, but... I'm gonna let them kind of spawn naturally. So if I leave for a little while, that'll probably happen. So we'll leave them to be because we just need to wait for the um, the chickens to kind of grow and stuff. That's n we don't really have to wait for anything else. We also have to wait wait for them to make eggs and things. So I'm gonna leave them behind. I'll also leave the sheep bait in here because I can't crowd them too much or they won't spawn. So stuff will naturally spawn anyways over time. But for now, look at that. There's five stacks in here. I haven't left this for that long, but there's five stacks already. So what we can do now is complete that questing section, which is this bio resources section so we're gonna just make everything it makes uh everything this item makes and that's it um a lot of these aren't emcable so we kind of just gotta do it i need seeds <laughs> Uh, all right, yeah, I need a few, I guess. So the next thing needed seeds. So this is grass seeds. Oh, but I made this already. Um, so grass seeds. This is uh, that which I already made. Then the next page, mushroom. Next one is. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this on my own really quickly. I'll be right back once I have them all done because it's gonna take a hot second. And that was the last thing we needed out of this quest line. So now we can go to the chapter rewards. Our very first actually completed reward thing. So with this, we get the bio generator and the crusher. I almost just lost them <laughs> because they didn't fit in my inventory. Um, there we go. <laughs> oh my God. Did these go into here? No, they do not go into here. I can't make those things. Um, I think pretty much nothing of what we just got was emc -able. Of course the wheat is, but pretty much everything else we made. Uh, pumpkins are, which is nice. And that's about it. 
it. <laughs> I don't know if we'll be even using majority of this stuff, but if we do want a lot of it, we're gonna have to grow it naturally. So, or do this, which is, this is what's going. So this is probably fine. We might not need a little farm for it right now. If we do want to have one for decoration later, I'll make one for decoration later. But for now, not necessary. I'm gonna get rid of a lot of these too, because we don't need majority of what's on here. Um, We don't need like anything on here anymore, oh, except for that flux thing, oh, which is gone now. <laughs> uh, Flux. Uh, where is it? Fluck linkage amplifier. That's what we want. That will make some stuff later so we can improve our machines. But that is our first 100% complete on a, on a chapter reward. So on our chapter, I guess, so bio resources, the easiest <laughs> is the first one to get done. Uh, but now what we need to do is wait for the chickens to grow so we can get some feathers um, and also wait for them to hatch an egg so we can get to that as well. So maybe we can get a chicken. It looks like that's a new one. Um, you are a new chicken, aren't you? Yes, there's two over here, actually. You and you can you breed so i can kill one safely there it is there it is okay so we got a feather from what i understand they haven't hatched an egg yet i don't think i didn't check the other one but i think they were all quite new so they probably none of them have hatched eggs so we'll come back in like a minute or two to come and check for the egg and that'll complete our first series of quest rewards as well or the first series of quest stuff and these are all emceeable and so are the seeds and now what we're on to next which is that's the last thing we need there viruses are done tend to get tinkering we'll get done later and return to steel is what we're doing next so what we need again is a bunch of stone uh, I'm gonna take this thing with me, but stone to make stuff. We're also gonna need some more chisels, uh, and then we're gonna take this with us. So what we are doing right now is expanding our base on the bottom. I'm gonna make all of these into this stone that I like, and then, that broke, <laughs> all right, that's fine. Um, and what we're gonna do is expand the base, probably in this direction. Can you go away, <laughs> please? Um, so we can uh, continue building some water wheels. So we're gonna have them a little out of the way. Probably going backwards is probably our best bet. So we can build them around here, around the back. They're very pretty though. I do quite like them because they're very a fun like kinetic sculpture <laughs> that exists and they just kind of move and they just look really cool. So we're gonna put them back here um, just so we can have some space because they are quite big and they do take up quite a lot of space. So I do want to have that as an option here. Um, so yeah, this should be fine. Let's make it a little bit bigger. Did I run out? No, I didn't. Why am I not able to put down? There's like a wall board or something. What's happening? Um, is this going to break if I use it again? <laughs> what? <laughs> What's happening? Okay, I'm going to just like leave it for now. Hopefully we haven't like crashed it, <laughs> I guess. I don't know what happened. I don't know. I can't place that anymore. But continuing on, let's just do this, light it up, and then we're going to keep building a little more. Um, I guess we're probably going to put them back here. So this should be pretty much enough space, but I do want to get a little bit more. It's just so we can have slightly more room. Uh, oh, it doesn't exist in our inventory. It was a fake. It was like blind. Interesting. Our, our system was a little out, so that's fine. Now I can get some more stone. Uh, I wish it showed up at the front because, like, God, that's annoying to have to go scroll for it. Okay, there we go. All right, and with that, that should complete our space for this. I, I think we're good on this uh, uh, completely. So what I'm going to do now is get some more wood because we're going to build this out of wood. Um, let's get some dark wood out. And then we're going to chisel it into that braided block because that's pretty as well. That is the end of my second chisel. So we can get another one. Um, and then put them all into this braided block. I think we don't need this much, but it's fine. So braided block, chisel, and that should be good. I'm okay on this. All right. So I'm going to put away these things because that we'll use them later. And now we have the braided stuff. Where's my food? There it is. Okay, there, we're gonna make a backpack here in a second actually, but first we're gonna make these water wheels so they can start being made and going. Um, I believe uh, we have all the kinetic stuff in here. This is what we need in here. Uh, well, we actually gotta make the water wheels first, so we might go do that quickly. Uh, so we need these treated sticks, we need the treated logs or whatever the hell we made, the treated wood planks. Um, and then what we're making is water wheels. So to do this, we need steel and we also need these things, immersive engineering stuff. That makes much of that. That makes much of that. So eight, maybe good. I might make a little bit more because I want to make a few more. I ran out of sticks, which is a good thing that I can pull out sticks from uh, this system because that makes it a lot easier. I don't have to worry about anything else. All right, so here, um, 18, I guess. We'll just make another four. Sure, yeah, that's good. That's exactly what I wanted. All right, so putting these away. Well, actually, we need these really quickly because I'm going to make the other thing to finish off the quest line we're gonna make the windmills so these are the things we need to make so i'm just doing this because I'm, I'm not gonna use these probably what I'm, I'm gonna do these for is just so i can have um okay we don't have space in our inventory please uh put these sticks away and we're gonna need to take out that creosote oil and use it really quick so here 
Um, pop. Okay, so what uh, What was I saying? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, we're just making this. I, I think that's what I was saying. We're just making this so we can um, get the quest out of the way. So we can get the quest reward, the full quest reward. I think we have to make this maybe, but I'm not sure. We might not. Those are kind of like optional things. So we probably will leave them alone. Um, I just need to make one of these. So I need iron. Um, bah, bah, bah. That's the last thing. And this should complete the quest reward for us, I think. The complete quest thingy, I think. I don't know, actually. Find out. And that completes the windmill but we do need to make the other thing okay so all we need to make is this early game option thingy so i'm gonna put this away since we're not gonna use them this way uh i need the kinetic dynamo and what we're gonna do real quick is make that block so we can finish off this quest system which it is just brick and sandstone which is gonna be really easy um so brick and sands and then we can make this thing in our inventory because it's that easy to make um so the kiln blocks that completes it so we don't even need to put the thing down, but we can if we wanted to. But I think it's just like a two by two, which let's just actually get them out. Um, so we can put this down. I can show you what this looks like since I don't know if we're actually going to use these, but you know, it's an option. Um, so two, two, two. And then I think it was like, where's the hammer? There's the hammer. There it is. Okay, so these make alloys. Um, from what I understand is that this makes an alloy. I think I can show makes the, no, I don't know. There was a way I, I looked at the thing, but it's fine. Um, we don't have to look at all the recipes, but it just makes alloys, makes combines different ores together and makes different ores that we might need later i have yet to figure out what we need to use it for but for now i think we're good we're okay on what we have and what we need so don't worry about it we'll come we'll come back to it eventually for now we're good so what i'm gonna do really quickly is create the base or the water wheels and just have them running i think from what i understand this is like the most optimal way to do it i'm actually not 100 percent sure on that but it may or may not be the most optimal way to do it not sure so what i'm gonna do is put this here as the outward block i think we need to have them like this um this might go all the way to the edge i'm not 100 percent on that like this so what we're doing is creating encasing because this is going to be is a water wheel it's gonna be running on water so i just don't want the water to flow out so let's get some water out. Like three buckets is fine. Uh, I need to make the base for where the actual thing connects. So where's our thing that we want to connect? It's there. So I'm going to put it on this side because this feels closer and understandable. I think if it goes here, a little low, it doesn't reach actually. We put it here maybe? There we go. I think that's the height we wanted at. So what we need to do is actually put the connect dynamo here first. And then we connect the rest of the objects. Um boop. Uh that's not gonna work, is it? Perfect. <laughs> I think we got it. Alright, okay, there we go. Uh can we do it like this? Yes we can. Okay. So the water wheel connects to this. And then we're going to connect the rest of the water wheels to each other. And that should spin the connect dynamo inside and make us a little bit of power for this system. I think this power works on most other like mods and stuff like that too. But it's perfectly fine the way we have it. I think um, this will work out and this is okay. We're going to just be using it for this thing. I don't think there's another reason to use this. Maybe there is. Uh, let me really quickly make this easier on myself and do this. Um, and then how far do we want this? Maybe is here good? Is that where we had it? I have no idea. I think that is where we had it. We're probably not going to walk through the back of this thing anyways. So that's fine. All right. So we just don't want the water to overflow. It was probably fine where it was, but probably okay. Is it fine where it was? I really wanted to have it where it was. Oh, okay. We're gonna put it back and hopefully it works. <laughs> Because I don't want to have this doing this. I want it to be here. Because I want to have a two walkway <laughs> uh, on this side. So we can walk through it. If we choose to, eventually. So uh, if you want to see the way I'm making it, I th I believe this is optimal. Not 100% sure on that. But I believe it is. Um, And then we're going to have a block up there. So we're going to up there in a second. I don't think we need this much space on this side either. I'm going to put this here. Because I don't think we need this. Up. And then that that and that so as long as we block it properly the water should only flow here um and i think it'll flow down through here so let's build a staircase on this side i guess um up to the top this up to the top okay so then what we need to do is create a wall i think about here um think about here so the water can flow maybe here actually um the water needs to flow across so i'm gonna do this and then we're gonna extend this platform this way hopefully this isn't constricting anything i don't think it is but it should be okay all right so then here right and then what we need to do is actually block this off so that the water cannot go this direction and that the water can also not go on this side up and then pop and then we'll make it a little more safe somewhere else but first we're gonna try it so this should be okay i think I think it's at the point where it should be. Now let's try water and see what happens. Okay, it is moving and it is staying. 
Um, but should this be farther back is my question, I think. Okay, farther back seems to be the way to go. So we're going to put it farther back. This is more of like the middle, I guess. Did I break it? Oh, shit, I thought I broke it. I think I glitched a texture. I am glitching textures, actually. I can see them popping in and out of existence. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Um, all right, so that's good. Okay, so we're going to light up this area just because we definitely have to do that. And then we'll put some more water. And then that's done. We just need to actually connect the power. And that's it. This is the easiest way to pretty much do this. And I think it's, it should work fine. Um, I'm going to need more water because that's not going to work. <laughs> so we'll be right back and get more. Look at that. Oh, it's flowing out. That's what I thought was going to happen. I need to put this here. Perfect. Okay, we need to fix that. That shouldn't happen. Uh, there we go. All right, so let's fix it on that side too. Uh, where's the block? It's like right here. Uh, or something like that. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, well, let's get some more water because we're going to need more water. Up, 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 up. All right, perfect. And let's swim over to the top and then put this down. See how easy this is? This is so simple. It's so easy. You know how perfectly simple this is. You know, I, I haven't played with this mod pack in a, or not this mod pack, but like this mod um, in a long time. And also this power is quite obsolete compared to like everything else. So I don't use it very often, but when I do get used to use it, it's very cool looking. It's very fun. Oh man, that flew. Um, and I just really love the way this like moves and looks. And it's just like, it's such an interesting idea and it looks so cool. You know, look at that go. Look at that. It's so sick. It's working, it's moving, and now all we gotta do is actually connect it, and then the power is complete. So what we gotta do is go get the connector. We need a connector here. This connector goes here, and the other connector goes over here. It might actually reach without having to put a relay in, but I'm not sure. Uh, so then this connects to this here, and then it'll tell us. So we have an LV wire, so we're connecting it from here all the way over here. So does it reach? Uh, hold on, get on top, please. It does, in fact, reach. But it says the connection is obstructed. It's obstructed by water, actually, which is annoying. So we can't do that. So what we need to do is have a relay point. So we're going to have a relay point here and have two connectors. So from here to over here, it sits there. Birds on a wire, we got the achievement. And then from there to there, the wire isn't obstructed. And the power is going up on the metal press. Look at it go. Immersive engineering power. Oh, okay. <laughs> and from what I understand, we're literally going to use it for one item. So come on, let's do this really quickly. <laughs> we can get into the tier twos really fast. All right. So we got the steel plates. I believe that's like what we need. This three steel plates, engineer wire cutters. I don't have wire cutters yet. I need to make those. Um, wire cutters. Uh, it is tree sticks and iron. So one, two, tree sticks and, and iron. Uh, where's the thing? There it is. Uh, iron up. Oh, that's not iron. <laughs> it is made of iron, but that's not what I want. Um, okay. Oops, engineering thing. This also has an EMC value, so I'm going to put it in there really quickly. And then put this in here, and then we can make the metal press for the plate. And that's it. All we got to do is put this in here. And now we are completely, completely prepared to go into the tier 2 progression. All I've got to do is make some of these items. And it shouldn't take me that long. So let's get to it, shall we? Let's see what we need. Okay, so to make the tier 2 stuff, we need these items. The tier 1... Uh, agglomerate uh, agglomerate i guess the tier one compressed agglomerate and the tier two resource generator let's start with the tier two research generator so we need a, a tier one resource generator first off um and then we need compressed sand compressed coal copper tin um iron um, bone and redstone so compressed everything so compressed sand we need two of those compressed uh redstone we need, do we need compressed redstone? Uh, we do need a block of redstone regular redstone redstone a block of redstone um, bone meal, so we're gonna need to take some of this out. We're gonna need to make uh, iron, so we're gonna give a block and tin and copper and uh, what was the other object that we needed? Uh, tin, copper, coal, and there might be something else I'm missing. Oh, we just need a block of coal. I got that already. Iron bone, yeah, we have most of the stuff, if not all of it already. So what we gotta do is make the block counterparts of these things. So there's the iron, there's the copper, and then there's the tin, and then there's the bone block. So these all combined together uh, will make the thing we need. So there we go. I'm going to put them all back in so I can make sure they're all in here. And then um, block maybe? Yeah, that'll be good. Uh, so a tin block, an iron block, a redstone block, copper, bone, and sand. We need two compressed sand. 
I think that's the entire recipe for this. Oh, cool. Uh, which is right there. And uh, that's it. That's all we needed. And that's the last time we'll make this because this also has an EMC value. So there it is. There's the T2 research generator. It is 7,179 EMC worth. I'm going to put it back in there for now. So what we also need to make is this compressed iron block, compressed coal block, compressed copper, and compressed redstone. So we need copper, redstone, and iron. I think those are the three blocks uh, and coal. So that's what we got to do. So we're going to do this thing again. We have the compressed iron already, or the compressed um, redstone already. Now we're making the rest of them. So we just need a coal thing. I thought I had pulled out the coal block, so I guess I didn't. Um, so there is everything. Um, all of it's in there. So now we can search compressed and pull out the iron, the thing, and the redstone, I guess. I don't know what we needed. What was it again? <laughs> um, and then these things to make this thing, we need the compressed coal. Um, compressed coal. So we're going to take back half of this. Compressed coal. There we go. Now we can make the tier one agglomerate, which this is where it's 108 thousand it's worth quite a lot and it did take quite a lot to make as you can see we, we ran out of like emc while we're trying to make it um so i had to put some iron back in so now we have that so now to make the next thing we need eight of those and a tier one mini catalyst so let's get the tier one mini catalyst thingy and then eight of these out i'm gonna get only eight because this is, they're worth quite a bit um and then we're gonna make the thing uh, which is this one this also has an emc value i'm gonna go mark it and then we're gonna use it. This goes into this machine. So it's not like that. I don't know why it's dirt. I don't, it's like the only thing I don't have is a shovel. And you drop it in there and then it makes it. And then it pops it out the back. Tier two mini catalyst. It's worth 8,701. Or eight, eight, no, that was wrong. That was really wrong. That was really bad. <laughs> that was really wrong. 871,722,000. 871,722. That's it. There we go. I'm good at math. I don't know what you're talking about. But that uses all of my EMC value. And that's why I had the iron running. And that's why I still have the iron running. Because God knows I don't have enough to even put one of these things down. So I need to go and get more iron. <laughs> so what we're going to do is not tear this down when we get the next one. So we're going to use another system. So we're going to place another system in the line um, and do that. So hopefully with all this iron that we have here, it should be enough, right? It should be enough to let us place down at least one and start making some diamonds um, and start automating it because God, I hope so. Um, so we're going to make another system running across like this. So we're going to do that really quickly. <laughs> we have, it's two million. I've got two and a half million, right? Um, so we're going to expand over there uh, the same way we did with this. It's not necessary yet, but we're going to start around the same spot. So what we're going to do is go grab all the blocks that we made last time, uh, not that one, this one, and then we're going to expand it a little more because that's exactly what we need to do. Um, so I'm going to expand it across that way. We're going to make a bunch of sections so we can make this next tier two thing. It's going to take a while for it to grow to this size, but if it does grow to this size, like anytime soon, it'll be so, so amazing in producing EMC. I cannot wait to use this because it's going to be so good it produces so much emc it, the diamonds are worth a lot just a few when i was doing it by hand was like so worth it and i was like damn i wish i could produce more but it's so goddamn expensive to put down anymore i couldn't do it so yeah and i was also making them in diamond blocks so it was like taking a little longer but this is what we're gonna do so let's get the item pipes that we need uh we have the thing with us i'm gonna put it here um so item pipes uh we're gonna put them in the sections pretty much where we need them so here is where we're building it. Um, I can build it like right here. So let's just give us a good amount of space and then put it like right here. Um, maybe I guess maybe like right here. Um, I don't want to. I don't want to leave too little space, but you know. So this is the space we're gonna do it with. Just like this, and then that's it. This is the section where we're gonna be building all this stuff. So we'll continue this later because obviously we're not gonna have enough to do it. So we're gonna take this out and take out a tier two mini catalyst. We can take out another one actually. We can take out two. It's great. So now what we're gonna do is put one down another one down do the connection thing and then put them in and then we're going to set up this system that we have over here as well so all we got to do is get out a bunch of those uh, sequential fabricators um as much as we can i guess like eight and then also sterling dynamos um and then there's a good amount is it a squid that is a squid that is there's a squid over there it has spawned in and it is dying it was a fish <laughs> oh my god <laughs> Wait, have I just made like a mob farm? What? <laughs> Wait, that's so perfect because I needed EMC. I needed Inferium Essence. I didn't realize. I remember I did this last time. This didn't spawn. Holy shit, I just made a fish farm. That's sick. Look at that. Look at those fish. Wait, all the items are flowing out the back. Hold on. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
I need to. Oh shit! Wait, I'm trapped. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> uh, what I need to do, actually, is grab this out. We're gonna move this out a block so I can. Oh my god! Wait. Oh my god! Look at all the fish. <laughs> They're all down there. Okay. What I'm gonna do really quickly. I was expecting this to happen. I'm gonna do really quickly is uh, make this into a section where I can actually save the items and maybe come back here every once in a while. Um, I hear something dying. Uh, there's a lot of fish down there, so those fish are gonna die. But the squid died and dropped essence, which I need essence to start magical crop stuff. So that's really nice. Okay. So I just got like three essence for doing nothing. But sick. Look at that. That one also dropped essence. Oh my god. It's not even seeable. But if I can make the seed, then it's essentially unlimited. I need eight of them to make an Inferium seed. If this keeps dropping stuff and keep and they keep dying, I'll be set on making Inferium stuff. <laughs> oh my god, I don't have to make a mob farm. Holy shit. Look at that. What the fuck is this? <laughs> this is so weird. That makes it look so much cooler though, because that fish spawn in here. But like, I was not expecting fish to spawn in here. That wasn't the goal. Like, that was just kind of like the side effect. Um... Are they supposed to drop? Oh my god, stop doing that. Please. Uh, did they not drop um, essence? They, I guess a few of them did. I guess it's like a rarer thing to do. Um, let me see. Is there a drop chance thing here? No, there's not a mob section. Oh, that's whatever. Okay, well, if there's more later, we'll collect more later. Let's keep making this system because I need to make this system. <laughs> uh, okay, so the pipe runs to the back. So this goes here. Not like that. Um, like this. Two, three, four, five, six. We're going to make the same system on the other side so i need one more there's a squid again all right so there and then there's the so it was eight actually that was actually the right amount um pop 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 um pop pop all right perfect so this is the new system um uh, this should be working eventually once i have this powering uh this isn't taking it out yet because i don't have the system set up but once i get to um item pipes again i don't know why i put them away I guess I was like, I'm done with them. Oh, I got cod now too, right? That's sick. I got some salmon. You use ink sacks. Oh man, that's so nice. It's like free resources that just kind of like fell out of the sky. That's so cool. Um, Which ones are the are the last two the only ones combining? I guess we can do pretty much that. Um, Have them running through all of them, except for like the last two. And then one of them will be making diamonds and one of them, or two of them will be making diamonds. And then the, I'll have another one actually extended over here. So we can do this. I want to I want to do one and add another one. Because I want to have one. They're all working now. Oh, well, this one has like nothing in it. Um, I think what I'm going to do is extend this back this way. And have only... Uh, have these two producing diamonds and these this last one making diamond blocks. So what we got to do right now is get these things out. Which now we completed that quest, I think. Diamonds, I believe, are this. Yes, they are that. Um, and then we're going to do that for all of these diamonds. And then these last three are going to be something else. So they're going to be diamonds. Um, they're be making diamond block actually. Oh yeah. Yeah. No, no, no. That's right. That's right. Because we don't have to worry about going from this to the nuggets to the iron. We're going to be worrying only about this. So this is fine. Um, so we're worrying about all these are making diamonds. We'll have the last like two or one making diamond blocks, but for now it's probably okay to just leave them kind of empty. So this will be making diamond blocks, these last two. I forgot that's how that worked, because I was like, there's an extra step with the iron, but for this, it's making diamond immediately. So there's not a worry about it. So the back is this. So this is importing on the back. The blue, the blue. So then all we're going to do also is ex export at the top. And the orange, so two, 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 and two. And then there. And then this is going to be importing at the top. And that's set up the way I need it, exactly. So everything is set up properly. These are exporting into these things, so they're going. All I got to do is actually have a coal system set up. So we need an oak drawer um, with coal. Um, I'm going to do it again with the two because it's just a little more secure. I don't have to go back and check them every off every so often. I've just got to put down two of them. So there we go. Um, the item pipes will run through the back. Um, we do got to disconnect them, though, from this thing. So there, 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 and there. There we go. Okay, so then they'll be pulling from here. And then all of the coal that we have will be put into here. So everything that we have possibly available. We can probably start using coal blocks soon, but I don't think I have enough EMC to actually do this yet. So for now, we're going to just keep using coal. And I think the coal blocks will take a little longer because they smelled for longer and they also just have more power but for now coal is fine it's working perfectly okay um so we'll just replenish these every once in a while obviously the one that's running the iron is still going and it just had two of these so it's not doing too bad i'm gonna go actually replenish them right now since i'm here so that's done and that's done i guess it's pulling out from that one more than is the other one so let's take out more of this dun, 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 dun. all right there we go and perfect all right so from here i think we're good i've just got to put this down 
and wait for the things to go. So these are making diamonds already. I'm gonna take this out because I do need to actually get some and use them to make stuff. So I have a stack and something on me. So let's really quickly make these things. Because this is, <laughs> I've already recorded for so long. I've been doing this for a while. And I'm really enjoying it, but oh my God, it's been 30 minutes. <laughs> it's been over 30 minutes. All right, so we're gonna make nickel. We're gonna make gold because we really need gold. We're gonna make lead and we're gonna make all the other stuff. I think one of these things isn't EMCable. Most of them are. Um, so there's zinc. Zinc is the one thing I think that isn't EMCable. Um, lapis is. Um, that's it. And we need the dialect paste as well. So that's um, coal and clay or something like that, right? So that was the recipe, I think. I don't remember actually. Um, but I think if you put an item here, yes, it pulls it back out. So it, it shows you what you want to see. Uh, so we're trying to make dialect paste. So back this way, like this. So now all of these can go into there. I'm going to just um, learn them because I really don't want to do this any other way. Because I don't want to pull them back out and be like, which ones were they again? So um, let's get gold out. Um, let's get lead out. And let's get all these things out. So what we're going to do really quickly is just do what we did last time and make all of the um, the ore variants of these things because there's no need to kind of have the nuggets. They're going to be quite useless. So what we should do is just make ores. I'm going to do the lapis just so I can have the block. Uh, and then the diamonds, I can also just kind of make the block in my inventory right now. Uh, but the system will be making blocks in a second. So there's the ores. There it is. Um, there it is. There it is. <laughs> there we go. Um, so put these back away and put that away, that away, that away, that away, that away. And silver and nickel and the only one we haven't made is the gold and we do need a lot of gold actually gold i think is something that modded packs use a lot and it's quite useful it's quite easy it's quite nice to have um so i'm gonna put these in here so we don't need them anymore and we're gonna have exporting these we're gonna have the system just completely ready so let me just do this really quickly so this is the system complete right so they're gonna be flowing into these last two which are gonna be making blocks and then these last two are gonna be exporting out the back um and going into a barrel so we need to uh disconnect these so there there, there and there that should work uh, and we're so they're exporting at the back so i need to do this up and up and then these are all exporting at the top so i need to get up there really quickly and do this up 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 up, up. perfect so now they're all set up the system is working properly i'm going to take the diamonds and we're going to make them over here so we can make diamond blocks um and that'll be the system so they're taking up less space and when i emc them they're a lot easier to grab and just take out <laughs> i don't have to worry about it too much um so you are exporting at the back. So this is what we made a four or section here. So one, two, three, four. And then we got to disconnect it here. And then we're going to have a little oak barrel section thing. Oak uh, three, four. Uh, so this shouldn't ever, I don't think it'll fill up anytime soon, honestly, just because that's probably not going to happen. Um, it's going to take a little while because this is going very slowly. But once they're done, I can take out more of this. Look, look how much this is worth. 147,456. Each one is half of that, right? So this going into the system is quite a lot more than the iron. The iron is still useful. It still has its uses because it, I, it's still constantly going. There's no need for me to tear it down. But it's much less <laughs> uh, per tick, I guess, right? So this is helpful because it helps me set up more later. But the diamonds are worth so, so much more. It'll become obsolete once I have a system even half as big as that, I think. You know, it'll become quite obsolete quite quickly. So right now we have two of these running. None of these are going to ever turn on. But eventually they all will turn on and it's going to be great. It's going to be a fun system. It's going to be so good. And oh my God, there are so many fish. <laughs> oh, there's more. There's more essence over here. Uh, I got one. That's it. <laughs> all right. Well, this was a fun little treat here. Um, we did get a lot done. Uh, we got all the way to the tier two system. Um, I think I'm pretty happy with that. I think we've got a good amount done today. Um, I do want to keep playing, but I don't know if I'll record again today. This is already my second recording of the day. I did the other ones earlier. I did episode three a second ago. Um, and now we're in episode four. And then we're going to go on to episode five. Oh, shit. We have enough for the essence. Holy shit. Okay. So what we probably will do in the next episode, actually, is get ready to make this um, and to use it. Probably not going to use it too much. But I do want to have um, Inferior Essence available because the um, mystical crop, uh, mystical block, Okay, mystical agriculture is what's called it has some pretty good armor and some pretty good armor systems i might use these because armor is usually pretty good in this pack um this does have the augments yes this is the same version i played last time so it does have really really good weapons and it has really good items to use the pickaxes are amazing the only thing i'm worried about is that none of these are of emc values um so i might not use a lot of these too often but the armor is really good i think there's like a um, 
I don't know if there's an unbreaking augment, but I know there's ways to like, I think there's ways to make it invincible or something. Maybe not, but either way, they're really good armor. I might use them for something, um, but we'll see. This is, none of these have EMC, so that sucks. But maybe that's not the way that this pack wants me to go, but we'll check it out. You know, we'll have the EMC ready, or not, uh, not the EMC, we'll have the magical, the mystical block or mystical crop stuff ready. And in case we want to use it, but we'll create a little farm, we'll create some of those little things, but we'll do that later. For right now, I think we're going to go take a hot break. <laughs> I'm really tired. We got a lot done today. I've been playing for a few hours, and I'm very happy about what we've done. We have this system up and ready. All I've got to do is kind of like let this system run and play. What I'm going to do, I think, is um, leave. and like, Well, I'm going to save it. Make sure to save it. Don't lose this progress. And then I'm going to leave and let this game run for a little while and just kind of like let this run so I can get a bunch of EMC because I just kind of want to wait for it to be done and then we'll slowly take out more. We'll put more of these things down, the tier two. So obviously I can put down one of these. I can put down a few of these, um, and but they're not they're not ready to be used yet. They're actually cheaper than I thought they were, but I can't do anything with them yet because they're going to take a little while. So, you know, I've got to do this properly. So all I got to do when, once I get there is fill these in and they're not done yet. But the core of the tier twos is like a million <laughs> so it takes a little while to get there but we made some progress we made some good progress we got a little fish farm going over there i don't know why i guess that we're at a good white level oh we're actually we're in a cold ocean um so we're in an ocean biome so the fish are spawning because there's water <laughs> so since we're in an ocean the fish just kind of spawn I, I i didn't think about that last time i wasn't in an ocean biome so i didn't i didn't have these effects <laughs> but that's really funny um but yeah i'm pretty happy with today's progress let's go look at everything really quickly before we get off but i hope you guys enjoyed it's been a, a lot of fun playing this pack and i hope you guys are enjoying this series so far um because I, I have yet to upload any of these things these have all been recorded one after another pretty much except for i recorded them yesterday and today um oh these run out of coal that's why these aren't working anymore that takes a while doesn't it these things burn coal very slowly um so that's really good though but that means that this probably stopped a while ago and that's why i don't have that much um so we don't have enough to make another one yet it's okay Ugh, okay but yeah um i've been really enjoying this pack i i have been recording these all i recorded one and two yesterday and i recorded three and four today um this is four there's the egg that completes it let's go okay 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 basic chapter done we can go complete that really quickly the chapter reward for this oh wait complete the tier two progression progression chapter oh since i did this i get two tier two thingies oh i didn't realize i was like why did i get that uh but that's cool okay we got more contending dynamos windmills and we got this all of this stuff i forgot to claim i guess when i got it earlier <laughs> oops okay so what we're gonna do really quickly um i'll throw that over there um is go put the things back in and we can go have them running is that bone meal on the floor um all right so putting this down so i can put some stuff away block of iron extra emc it's always nice can't put any of that away um but i got a few of these things ready so resource generators this thing uh oops this and this this one's running this one's running this one's running this one's running this one isn't and this one isn't but now they are look at it oh my god these are running much faster now now we should be able to get more diamonds quicker because we got those two and we can put down another one. Oh my god holy shit this, this is why I get too excited and I, I can't end things because I'm like holy shit this is so cool and then the episode doesn't ever end and I'm like oh wait what about this thing and I'm like what about this thing oh my god look at this thing and I'm like uh huh uh huh uh huh <laughs> so yeah we're gonna end now before anything else happens but now we got it all done we got steel we got zinc we got connect dynamos um and there's a lot of fish stuff that we got to collect because this is definitely dropping stuff. Maybe I should put like um, a hopper here, like an ender hopper once I get uh, <laughs> ender pearls so I can uh, get all that shit that's dropping because it is also a, a little bit more EMC. It's not a lot, but something or just food. You know, it's kind of funny to have it fall. I might as well pick it up um, or put it in there for now. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy with this. Our progress is going. We're making some good progress. I'm very happy with how far we got. We got all the way to the tier twos, on to the next quest. What is, what's next? Next after this is the PSIs, the mystical agriculture stuff, and more power uh, to get more good power, industrial foraging. Uh, dimensional resources is probably the next thing we'll work on because we need to get some glowstone for certain things. To get, work on EMC, we need to get glowstone. So we need to start working on the nether things. So we'll get there soon. Uh, there's also refined storage. Uh, well, Project E, we need to go to the dimensional resources. So we'll do that. Um, there's Batania, there's Flux Networks, um, Humble Beginnings, Copper Age, and the Brass Age. I'm not even sure what half of these things are. Oh, this is Create, isn't it? Um, I think, maybe. This looks like Create. Um, 
but yeah so we need to complete most of these things before we get to the tier threes this is gonna take a little while we're not gonna be here yet but we'll be here soon but we'll complete all of these things first and we'll get all the nether stuff first too so we'll get some like netherite scraps and like um and all this kind of stuff and probably go i don't know if we'll skip this end stuff because i don't think we're in, a, in the progression we should be there yet but when we get there we'll get there we'll figure it out in the next episode but for now i'm happy and i hope you guys have been enjoying there will definitely be more i'm gonna try and finish this entire series because I, I i'm really enjoying myself doing this and i really really want to continue so i hope you guys are enjoying this and I will see you all in the next episode. We made some good progress today. And I'm excited to keep going. <laughs> I'll see you on the next one. Please, um, if you want, if you would like, like and subscribe. And, you know, subscribe to see the next episodes. They'll be coming out soon. And uh, I'm going to try and do Monday, Wednesday, Friday. By this point, you'll see a week of progress probably. <laughs> so this, is, this should be coming out on a Monday um, again. So this should be the second week that we're doing this and I, I i hope this goes well and i hope we continue this since i'm recording them so early and so quickly i'll probably be able to go through more than one pack over the summer because i'm not sure what happens when school starts but if you guys are enjoying and if you are liking what i'm doing and you show me that you're like what you that you like what i'm doing then i will try and push to do this during university when i when i go back in the fall um but you guys got to tell me that if it's not going super well and you guys aren't enjoying it as much maybe i won't continue doing it during the fall uh, until next summer or, or yeah probably next summer again but if you guys are really enjoying this and i see that you guys are enjoying this and then i'm really enjoying this um i'll continue it and i'll keep going during the school year so please tell me that if you guys are enjoying so far this is already episode four so yeah i guess i'll see you guys in the next one see you guys in episode five i hope you guys have been enjoying this <laughs> see you guys then bye